What's up folks, this is Joel here at the Chicago Music Exchange. Start things off with the bang, we got a Gretsch Master Built 1955 White Falcon built by Stephen Stern, who is the king of uh, the Gretsch Custom Shop. Master Built, if you're not uh, familiar, means that Stephen Stern built this thing by hand, by himself, from the ground up. Uh, when one person builds everything, carves it himself, puts it together, hand selects the pickups and all the parts and the wood, makes sure it all marries together nicely. What you end up getting is a guitar. It kind of has a uniform purpose and everything goes well together and it wasn't just haphazardly put together using parts and part machines and part people. It was all hand selected by one guy. He did all the gluing, did all the binding, did all the fret work, all the carving, and one guy. So ebony board, laminate maple body, you know, gold hardware. Sounds like the 50s. Um, looks like the 50s. Um, the, the relic job is pretty phenomenal. There's some checking, um, really, really good looking checking in the, in the lacquer. Again, stuff that looks hyper realistic. Hard to believe that somebody figured out how to just do this to the guitar, make it look this way. And it's got the awesome kind of orange gold flake binding. And the vintage correct, the G tailpiece, which is awesome. This is just, you know, this is kind of like the Cadillac of vintage guitars, blingy flashy, uh, nothing subtle about it, and it's not supposed to be. Under the hood, this thing has the Seymour Duncan Antiquity uh, Custom Shop, the hand-wound Dynasonics, which are obviously based on the, the Armin Dynasonics they used to put in these. And uh, if you're not familiar, it's a really fat, warm-sounding single coil. I'll give you a quick little demo here. The bridge is, you know, you can almost get like telly type stuff out of it. And then in the middle, you get kind of like that quintessential. You know, kind of spanky, great for the, uh, you know, old school finger picky lead type stuff. And then uh, I love the neck pickup, it's, you know. It's really sweet, really musical. Does that like fat, slappy thing when you really hit it hard, which I love. That's kind of like what makes, for me, what makes a good neck pickup is if you snap on it. Um, you, can, you can hear your fingers a little bit. It's not just, you know, microphone. You actually hear the uh, singer. So if you are looking for that Dynasonic sound and you can't find any 50s, 60s Dynasonics out there, those uh, antiquity custom shop ones are A+. Plus. That's what's in here. So it did uh, some interesting stuff for the demo. Used the, uh, the Ditto X2 looper to do some uh, kind of interesting original uh, looping stuff, which kind of showcased all the different pickups, pretty much clean. And then um, did She Sell Sanctuary by The Cult. Uh, Billy Duffy played uh, White Falcons pretty famously, one of the more famous rock guitar players as opposed to Rockabilly and the type of thing that played these. So a uh, pretty iconic riff and um, used the, the Alexander history lesson which is a great delay pedal. Used the, uh, the 80s setting for that and got a pretty cool, pretty legit cult tone. And then uh, I did just, I don't know, kind of a weird little version of Norwegian wood that I just kind of picked out with uh, some overdrive courtesy of the Little Samson by Greer Amplification. So for the amp, I wanted to get something that was, uh, could get me a really kind of sparkly, hi-fi, clean tone that also had uh, spring reverb on board. So I chose my favorite two rock amp, which is the Crystal, and this is a 22 watt Crystal combo. So I hope you dug it. It was an absolute joy to play. This is an incredible guitar. Again, Stephen Stern, Masterville 55 White Falcon from the Gretsch Custom Shop. Mm -hmm.